While the sun was rising on the foothills of the Shenandoah Valley, as it would on other main streets, what was happening in New York was nothing ordinary. A company founded some 17 years ago on an idea so simple it seems almost magical. Learn another language from Rosetta Stone. Had now grown to the point it was welcomed on Wall Street and thus able to reach a new kind of global audience. Rosetta Stone making its debut this morning on the New York Stock CEO Exchange. CEO Tom Adams the rang the opening bell. It will be the first language instruction company to be publicly listed. Ticker there on the NICE RST. Rosetta Stone is going public. Rosetta Stone surging at the open. They're up 40%. It was a very emotional uh, moment for all of us. It's just seeing all these hard work resulting listing in the New York Stock Exchange was just phenomenal. It was amazing. I mean, we've dreamed about this, but we didn't think that it was actually going to be so emotional. In 2006, when I interviewed with Tom, he was talking about taking this company public. And so for me, it's just a, it's been a labor of love. And now to see this culmination has been just so exciting and uh, real rewarding for the team. Rosetta Stone is not your ordinary company. It runs on human energy fueled by intelligence and a pinpoint focused mission to make language learning available to everyone. And that means everyone. Just try keeping up with CEO Tom Adams. Okay, well, welcome to Rosetta Stone. My name is Tom Adams. I'm CEO, and I'm going to show you around today. When we started working to take the company public about a year ago, we settled on the name for the project as Project Churchill. A reason being that he had said some wise words about this is not the end, not even the beginning of the end, but it is maybe the end of the beginning. We're sort of celebrating that thought that this is a new start for the company and we're only just getting started at conquering language learning. That's a packed room if I've ever seen one. Guys, what are you guys up to? Training. 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 When we think about what we're doing in this industry, we are not here to make a small impact. We're here to change the overall way people learn languages. And for it to really work, it needs to work in a natural way, in a way that's natural for the learner. And the only way to accomplish that is to avoid translation, not confuse the learner with any grammar explanation. And doing that in a technology-enabled way has not been done by, any, by anyone before. So this team develops content development tools. At any given time, editors, writers, translators, voices working around the world, creating all of our products. If you're out of breath, that's because at Rosetta Stone, there's no time to relax. Well, maybe just for a sec. No. There we go. Debe de tener algo que dice Rosetta Stone. With a personal edition of our program, we haven't set up really. Rosetta Stone language learning solutions are offered in 31 languages and can be found in more than 150 countries. The latest innovations are bringing the language learning experience to even greater heights. Mike Fulkerson, Senior Vice President of Labs. Speech recognition is an integral part of our product. It's not just what we call parroting. Hear something and repeat it. It's actually generate something novel based on what you're seeing in context of the program. Brian Pelham, Senior Director of Speech Technologies. Our goal is to mimic the human uh, bound of performance and provide our customers with the best uh, quality experience possible. We do fundamental research. We do core development of speech technology. We find the best ways of integrating uh, speech recognition technology and apply it in the best ways for uh, language learning. Yvonne Drums, senior editor, has been with Rosetta Stone right from the start. The product back then was just as exciting as it is now, but now we have so much more to offer and it's, the quality is so much better. And teaching language by immersion through technology is all about finding solutions. Jack Marmestein, principal researcher in labs. And we came from all over and brought all these talents and came up with a solution that no one had ever thought of before and continually come up with those solutions, be it a custom product for the military, be it a custom product for endangered languages, be it an online community or an e-school experience. Greg Keim, 
chief technology officer. We can design activities and exercises that, uh, that really focus on exactly what the person needs, uh, we sometimes call it actionable feedback, uh, that we can find exactly what's wrong and then suggest something to, to fix that. We're always looking to do something just different. Rosetta Stone solutions are not only unique and different, but they're magical. And this magic is so striking. When they pull you in, that's the magic. I mean, you're, you're learning. Right away, you get a very small vocabulary of 40 or 50 words, very quickly. And then the microphone pops up, and you're, you're pulled in. You have to say something. We, we talk about this aha moment. We call it the aha moment. When you do use it, you have that aha moment. And you realize you just said something in a new language without having to memorize it or think about it at all. What's amazing about, uh, about human beings is we can sort of take all these language and not get confused at all. That feeling of success, like, ah, oh, not only have I learned it, but I've, I've used it, and now it's mine. It's the voices coming at me, it's how fast I can move in and out. You're traveling in the story, people approach you, they ask you a question, you have to answer. When you see the product on the screen and you see people kind of getting it and learning languages and being able to better themselves. When I learn a language using a Rosetta Stone solution. The only limitation is me. I really do believe that it builds upon natural learning processes that everybody has. And Rosetta Stone is ready to take virtual what has been known as the product in the yellow box to the global online community. Christopher Spiller, Senior Director of Online Experience. And that's where learners can connect with other learners using Rosetta Stone. They can play games, uh, activities, chats. We don't want to be just another social networking site. There's plenty of those in the world. We want to be a site about language learning. It's a site that you can go to and practice with native speakers or practice with other learners. It's a very safe environment. So if you want to sit there in your pajamas without doing your hair, that's fine. Rosetta Stone began with an idea on Main Street, went public on Wall Street, and is now going global. It brings people together across the world, across different cultures, and it's very simple and easy to navigate and really a great, enjoyable experience.